uh, we sadly reported on earlier. Uh, 14 children he confirmed have been killed in this shooting along with a teacher at Robb Elementary School in the Uvalde uh, district there. The alleged gunman is also dead and we have just uh, received an image of that gunman, 18 years old. Our investigative reporter Aaron Katursky with me now. Aaron, what more do we know about uh, this uh, suspect who is now dead, believed to be a member of that community and that school district? Indeed, David, he's identified by the governor of Texas as 18-year-old Salvador Ramos, a student at Uvalde High School, and he is believed to have shot and killed his grandmother before entering Robb Elementary School and opening fire with a firearm that has not yet uh, been made clear, according to police. They're still trying to track down the weapon. Shot and killed 14 elementary school students along with one teacher, and law enforcement sources tell us, David, that the suspect, 18-year-old Salvador Ramos himself, was killed there at the scene. And Aaron, again, Salvador Ramos believed to be a student in that district. A student in the very community uh, where he opened fire, it's believed, according to police, a student at Uvalde High School. Whether he was still going to classes or whether he had stopped going hasn't been made clear. But according to the governor of Texas, Greg Abbott, Salvador Ramos is or was a student at Uvalde High School, the very community where Robb Elementary School is located that came under fire by this gunman after he had shot and killed his grandmother. Authorities are now trying to go through his background to see what connection he may have had to that elementary school. They're also trying to run down social media and find any potential friends or acquaintances just to see if there were any accomplices or anyone else who may have had an inkling that this shooting was about to come, David. All right, that is the major headline coming in right now. Uh, the suspect, the image of him just a short time ago uh, made public. Uh, again, uh, an 18-year-old believed to be a member of that community and a student at the high school there. Uh, Governor Abbott, again, confirming that number we came on the air with uh, a bit ago earlier this afternoon when we reported that we believe that up to 14 children uh, could be dead. And now, sadly, the governor has confirmed those numbers along with uh, just a few more details uh, of what played out this afternoon. Let's